In the aggregate markets, there's really three major groups, the asphalt, concrete, and then the general construction aggregates. Our aggregates are in high demand due primarily to the types of work that is being released. We've done more slurry projects than we've ever done in the past in 2019. We see that continuing through 2020 as the public funding for those types of projects continues. We continue to have the greenest concrete in the market. Obviously the local sources and our ability to use slag, fly ash, and the materials that count as recycled content. So we do continue to see that demand, more so from the engineering architect communities, but obviously our customers are on board with it. We have five different locations. Some of them are close together, some aren't, but every single one of them has its own really niche market. The natural stone business is a big deal for us here in the Monterey Bay. We're really finishing the year strong in 19, but beyond that, it's really the landscape products, bulk aggregate. The demand is good right now, and we're taking advantage of our opportunities, and we believe 2020 is gonna be the same. We're really glad to see the recycle markets continue to have strength. We offer recycle products here, and that does diminish some of the virgin supply, but we can put those to a higher and greater use into the concrete and asphalt markets. We really don't see a dip. I, I think in certain areas, we're gonna see some leveling out, but as far as roadway maintenance, the public infrastructure projects, I see that being strong going forward. So we have a much stronger backlog going into 2020 than we did in 2019. And so we're gonna grow our volumes right now by at least 10% year over year in the hot mix business. And that's due to a lot of the SB1 money that construction division was able to land those large jobs. Going into 2020, we're seeing some additional large Caltrans work out there. So we think that's gonna be a good opportunity for more volume next year. There's kind of a general softness in the market. We definitely know that that's out there. However, with our vertical integration, we feel that we are well armored to protect ourselves from that softness. And we are well prepared to be able to supply aggregates at a very efficient level. So there may be softness, but we're right in our wheelhouse of production.